y'all, it's Vlogtober. I'm gonna say Vlogmas. <laughs> it's Vlogtober day eight. Yeah, it is 9.45. I am editing today's video. Um, I had just put on my community tab that the video was gonna be up later today just because last night we had movie night and y'all, I fell asleep. <laughs> I fell asleep, I was so tired. Um, I let myself rest because I think I've been doing pretty good. I think I deserved some extra sleep. <laughs> But I'm up now editing, but I'm about to stop here uh, in about an hour or so to go drop these orders off and then come back and finish editing if I'm not done yet. And then once I'm done with that, then we'll get dressed and get ready to go to the pumpkin patch. My best friend actually called me and asked me what time we're leaving. I told her I don't know yet <laughs> once I get my work done. So yeah, it is cold outside today, guys. That's why they have their jackets on. Um, I mean, it's not freezing. They're good, but y'all know we in Texas. They're true Texans. So to them, 50s is freezing, like in the 30s to them. It's 59 degrees right now, so it's not that cold. But they wanted to go outside. They said they're chilling. Their hands started to get cold, so they asked for their um, their mittens. So I put them on there, but they want to stay outside. So as long as um, let them get some fresh air. We used to play outside all the time. So, especially uh, if it was like still a little cool outside, I just let them go out in their pajamas because it was like random. They were in the playroom playing and then they were like, mommy, let's go outside. Look at Aaron. <laughs> Hold on, get Aaron. What's up? Come here. Come on. Okay, Abby. Are you going to go back outside? Okay, go outside, baby. Ain't no running in and out. You either in or you out. <laughs> okay. Um, whoo wee. But yeah, I just got on here really quick to start the vlog. I'll check back in with you guys when I'm done with this and moving around. You guys <laughs> talking about testing patients and I'm trying to like legit calm down because I'm getting irritated I didn't even want to pick the camera up if I'm gonna be honest I'm I'm not about to get up here and complain but I'm, I'm it's just a lot <laughs> and it's always during PMS week that's why when everything feels like it's just going crazy but trying to get this video up to you guys it's not like I'm not able to import the music into the project so I can export it and upload it to YouTube that's what's holding me up I've been trying to do that for like the last 30 minutes um it's 1 30 we still in pajamas well I had to put this on because I went to the post office the girls are still in pajamas because we we're supposed to go to the pumpkin patch still haven't done that my house looks a complete mess 
I'm turning my computer off right now because it's gonna piss me off. <laughs> Last night, I don't like, it kind of messed me up. I don't regret movie night, obviously. That's my time with my family, but normally I edit the night before just in case stuff like this happens and it doesn't put me behind. And it put me behind. Then I wanna take a nap. I wanted to take a quick nap because I fell asleep during movie night and I felt so bad. Um, like I was, I, obviously I wasn't like in a deep sleep. I kept dozing off and then I would like try to sit up and watch the movie. And then I got up at like five this morning because my body is just used to getting up. So really from like 12 to five, that's all I slept. And so I'm tired. Erin is over here taking a nap now. I know some of you guys, it, it was a couple of them and it's been asked like throughout the last few months if I consider getting like a cleaning service uh, or like hiring people to come clean. And I have thought about it, like I'm not gonna lie, I have thought about it, but then at the same time, for one, I'm frugal, y'all. I don't wanna spend no money. I don't like spending money. I will if I have to. I don't mind spending it on my kids, but just, I don't know, I feel like that's just a waste of money for me. And I get like, I'm paying for convenience. I'm trying not to blind y'all, sorry. I would be paying for convenience, but I feel like that's something that I can do. It's just a matter of me doing it. So I, I know I have a lot going on. I, I run. I work full time. I got two kids, a husband and two side hobbies. So I am very busy. But at the same time, I look at it like that's a part of like, that's how I'm able to give back and take care of my family. Like I cook and clean, provide, like make, make my house a home for my family. That's a part of my job. That's how I look at it. I know a lot of that's, that's touchy for some women. I just, I don't know. I still value what it means to be a woman, I guess. And so I'm not saying like I don't ever need help. I'm definitely not saying that. But I like to clean. I don't know. That's I don't know. I, long story short, I like to do it. So I'm about to try this again. If it doesn't work, then I'm not taking a nap. I'm not even going to hold y'all. And I already told Ari, let me see. I'm going to look at the pumpkin patch and see what time they close. Because we haven't gone at night. That might be a new experience. We've always gone during the day. So maybe I'll do that because it is so early enough. I might take me a little nap and then get us dressed and then maybe we'll go to the pumpkin patch. Like we'll we'll do like a night experience. Yeah, I'm so irritated. I'm trying not to be, ooh. And it don't help that I'm PMSing so I'm like extra irritable. I need to make sure Aston's up because he has to go to work. He gotta go to work. Y'all see how much my husband works and I be laughing because like I would get a few comments in my cleaning videos when they be like Where is your husband? Your husband don't help you. Like y'all this man is always at work. He's always at work So yeah, he helps when he can when he's home and when he's not asleep, but other than that this man works I've been debating if I've been wanting to pick the camera up. First of all, um, I took my nap. I did take my nap. And I've been laying around doing absolutely nothing. I know y'all can't see me, but I'm trying. I'm, I need a break away from my kids right now, so I'm trying to hide upstairs. Not so much Ari, it's Erin. And I hate to single her out, but goodness. <laughs> but yeah, I woke up from my nap, and then I was just laying around. I finally was able to finish editing the video, so I just made that live. So you guys see that, um, I didn't do much today. So we really didn't go to the pumpkin patch, clearly. Um, I just wasn't feeling it today and I feel so bad. I like, I hate telling my kids that I'm gonna take them somewhere and then I don't. But if mommy just doesn't have it, then mommy ain't got it. I might take them tomorrow, I don't know. So I haven't said anything yet because I don't want them then to be expecting to go tomorrow and then I don't go tomorrow. So, but being that we didn't go today, I'm about to start on some cleaning actually just because my house looks like we've been here for the last two days. So I need to start doing some straightening up and get a headset, uh, head start on my Sunday reset. Aston's at work. Um, tomorrow's Sunday football too, so, and I'm making Sunday dinner before he goes to work. I'm tired, y'all. I feel like I need a break. I love my kids, but I don't think anybody talks about this side of motherhood, of it just being completely overwhelming sometimes and it's a thankless job. It is a 20, what they say, 25-8. So it's 24-7, so yeah, 25-8 job. <laughs> and 
I feel like a lot of moms don't talk about it because then a lot of moms like is people are so judgmental when it comes to to mothers and I don't get it like we all ain't struggling in some sort of way in some sort of way somewhere in the, our motherhood journey somebody's struggling I don't y'all can act like y'all got it together but child so it's not always like this but when it does get like this I feel like it's important to have community and friends and somebody that you can talk to about it because if not like you just gonna you're gonna go crazy you are going to go crazy it's like no matter what you got to pull it together because who else is gonna do it who else can they depend on i mean yeah they got their daddy but <laughs> it's gonna fall on the mama i tell y'all that all the time golly it always be the thing on mama and then it'd be funny because in times like this when i'm overwhelmed i'll be like i want my mama <laughs> <laughs> shoot i'm 34 i want my mama yeah i'm not by any means like trying to make this like negative or complain but at the same time this is real motherhood is not always peaches and cream it's not and yes i'm hiding from my kids yes i'm about tired of them today yeah i am i am i'm, I'm not even going yeah i have i have those moments <laughs> but do i love them to death i do and I wouldn't trade my kids for nothing in this world. I would not. Today is just today. Tomorrow is a new day. So we'll see how tomorrow goes. But today, I'm about to just clean up. Um, I am about to... I did tell Ari we can play. She want to play Twister. Why she want to play the game that, like, I'm? if I slip, slide the wrong way, I'm going to hurt myself. But that's what she want to do, so... And I'm just like, can you play that with your sister? But Erin's arms and legs is about this big, so she can't do nothing. But yeah, I had just poured me like a little bit of wine, but I think I need some more. That'll solve all my problems. <laughs> I'm about to... Actually, I can finish separating clothes. I can finish separating clothes in preparation for laundry tomorrow. Because I don't think I'm going to wash no laundry tomorrow. But I do like to... I mean, today. But I do like to separate, and I already have it like my load's ready so as soon as I wake up first thing in the morning throw that bad boy up in there hey y'all it's a little later I got on my um Halloween pajamas again but I'm gonna go ahead and wrap the video up here just because Hi. it's 7:20. um and I, I want to give the girls like some undivided attention the last few days I've been obviously I'm vlogging which is all part of the content but I don't want them to feel like mommy gotta work mommy gotta work all the time so and then it doesn't help that I fell asleep on <laughs> on her. Erin fell asleep with me. Um, so she was the only one really watching the movie last night. So we're going to put on another movie. I'm making their dinner now. And she's waiting on me to do some of these um, activities. But yeah, I just want to give them some mommy attention. I hope that you guys enjoyed today's video. If you guys aren't already subscribed, please consider hitting that subscribe button before you guys head out. And I will see you guys in the next video.